Hi guys! I'm so excited to vlog! I'm back to vlogging because we have a really exciting and very eventful week ahead of us. It is Art Basel in Miami. Art Basel is a week that's filled with art and artists and talent and visuals and fashion and I am so so excited to dive into it. I actually came to Art Basel two years ago. It was my first time and it was such a blast if you guys remember that vlog. This year it is just like three times the size and the brands I'm gonna be working with this week are one of my all-time favorite luxury brands so I'm just really excited to have these like new experiences and new collaborations and I'm so excited for you to come with me it's gonna be feeling a lot different now that I live in Miami to actually experience our basil I feel like before when we came it felt a little bit different so uh, it's gonna be interesting to find my flow here. We have a very busy week. Gary's actually joining me to a lot of the events. So it's gonna be really fun to see how he's integrating into this crazy world of what I do for a living. But I'm sure it's gonna do great. He went shopping for clothes because he's like, I can't be wearing my Balenciaga sweatpants everywhere. And I was like, yeah, you are correct. It is time to move on. And by the way, you see, Gary, you look great in Balenciaga. Like no hate on Balenciaga, you look amazing. But you look amazing in other things as well. The first thing that we have, I'm just gonna dry my hair, uh, is fitting for Ferragamo. I actually have a couple of events with Ferragamo, one lunch that I'm hosting, which I'm very excited. And I'm gonna be seeing a lot of my peers that are coming into town and it's gonna be great. And then I have this Dior uh, cocktail at Superboo, which is a really cool museum. And then we have another party, like an after party for this NFT thing, which is also makes me wonder how Art Basel is gonna look like this year with just like like NFTs and all that stuff, like are most art gonna be an NFT? I don't know. And I'm really, really hoping that I actually will get a chance with Gary to see and actually view and look at some art. I love these like marathon type of like weeks, you know? Gives me back those like butterflies and just like excited. Okay, we are on our way to a fitting with Ferragamo. We are looking for two outfits one for the lunch that i'm hosting and one for dinner that we have with them after that we going back home i need to get hair and makeup for sure and then we are gonna be shooting some content that we need to do and then the dior cocktail wow we are waiting for a dress to arrive because i don't have what to wear the original dress that we were waiting on never arrived so we have to do some last minute maneuvering and hopefully this one will arrive if not it's black pants black shirt and heels kind of nice just getting their stuff out we're been very functional this morning like too functional so they're still functional. Uh, functional. what did i say functional. functional because it's punctual and functional it's functional we've been very functional this morning they're just taking out some stuff but there's already like some really cool stuff that i'm seeing that i like some colors run This like fits you like a glove. Yeah, no, this one feels great. Taking it and taking it. This can also be something. The shoes are here? Yeah. That coat is gonna drown me. But this is very cute, I love this. Planning to wear. Yay! That's it, we're ready. I'm gonna change. <laughs> Thank you so much. Bye, have a good day. Finished our feelings, feeding fittings with Ferragamo. Chose two outfits for one of the luncheon lunch luncheon that I'm having with them and one a party after like in the evening. So I feel good about it. It's always so nerve-wracking because you don't know what's available. A lot of the time brands sometimes won't have your size, but I'm excited about the outfits that um, I chose and tried on and I was the first fitting for the day. So, and the weather I feel like really agrees with the outfits that I've chosen because it's not like your typical crazy hot Miami. It's like really nice and breezy 
and I needed to stay. I'm not wearing leather, and long sleeve, and a trench. Help me out here, Miami weather. Hey. Hi. How are you? You can start, and mm -hmm. then we can slowly build up. Exactly. Okay. I'm worried she has a lot of volume. But if the, if the dress comes in, do you think it would still work with the dress? No. But I don't see that the dress is coming in. You know? It's 4.06. At what time is it? We have to leave here at 5.50. So I'm hoping it arrives by 5.50. Mm -hmm. Hi, Benny. Hi. Let's go to my mom and make up. Okay, now go to my mom. Hi, boys. So the spelling bee has done today. Ben got first place in practice. Wow. And I got first place. First place? Fifth? Fifth. Um, I love you. We're getting ready for our event tonight. We have the Dior medallion event. And things, like always, are not going by plan. Because my dress is on here. The bathroom smells disgusting. Oh no! But we're gonna improvise. It might be a suit tonight. The glam team is gonna pull this through. Yes, this is what we've been waiting for! You got it? Are you sure you got it? Yes, I got it. You got it? No, I don't got it. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you're my good luck charm. Maybe I'm not. <laughs> I think you are. This looks big. It's gonna be big? Yeah. Oh my god. So when were you planning on wearing this dress? For the front row event. Which is? Tomorrow. I see. Plan B it is. I need to see if the black dress fits. This look is on fire. Yeah. Do we think it's gonna fit? Perhaps. Maybe. I hope so. Hope so. Hope so. It's giving me Angelina Jolie Maleficent. Like, yeah, from here. Definitely. The hair is so cool with it. Yeah. Because <laughs> the socks. I feel like you're gonna be stressed cry right now. Who is a big boy, Maxi? He goes, I'm Maya. Maya. Yeah. I don't play bubbles. You wanna play with bubbles? Okay. Okay. Bye, love you. Bye, love you, Maxi. We are ready to go. 100% overdressed, but look at this glam. Ah! Can you come here for a sec? Can you just hold? You look great, babe. Yeah? Uh -huh. You're like a princess. A cool princess? Yes, a cool princess. <laughs> We're on our way to the Dior cocktail. I'm a fashionista. You are, you're wearing a suit. You've been really stepping out of your comfort zone. This is gonna be really cool. We're going to the Super Blue Museum and they have the exhibit there. You like my makeup? Yes, it's on fleek. No one says that anymore. We're right now at the Super Blue, ready to party. But first waiting for Jen to take some photos.
Okay, that's a wrap on day one, our basil. The exhibit was really cool. Did you enjoy the exhibit? Cool. Gary is just speechless. Sorry? Did you enjoy the exhibit? Yeah, it was uh, very artistic and it broadened my horizons. <laughs> Anyways, it was a great exhibit. I uh, got to see uh, some friends and um, that's it. It's time to go to sleep now. We have an early day tomorrow. Good morning! Art Basel day two. Ready. Oh my god, I need this drink. Oh, 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 oh. Just waiting for my glam. Woke up at 5 a.m. to put a mask on to revive the skin a little bit. Marco is coming to do my hair and makeup. Love Marco. He's amazing. And Today on the schedule, we have Tiffany's uh, breakfast and then I have another event with Dior and this is to look at their Lady Dior art, which I'm very excited about. What I really love about Art Basel is that unlike Fashion Week that is really all about fashion, this is a merge of art and fashion. So I feel like it's so interesting and cool to see all these brands and all these fashion houses bring their art into play in other forms but clothes so yesterday was a great example with the dior medallion chair exhibit which was really cool and today we have more of it and then this evening i have a dinner with uh, my friends from the daily front row it's a nice day i'm gonna make myself a little bit of breakfast before marco arrives and some coffee and Let's get it. Woo, look at that hydration. I use the Sicily Rose Mask. I like it. The bracelet, the spikes look sick. So good, right? Okay. Okay, we are ready. We're gonna go to our first event, the Tiffany's breakfast, and then we are heading to the Dior event. Oh, 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 oh. Be careful with this. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Thank you so much. Celine. Shine bright like a diamond. Thank you. My have knees fun. will be the Bye. shiniest. showcasing this insane necklace that actually Beyonce was wearing in their new campaign with Jay-Z. It is amazing. The event is really cute. There's like breakfast and some coffee which I'm gonna go get and uh, we just found an escape in this little room and we're gonna be heading out to the next one soon. a little matcha breakfast break heading to Dior now we are going to see the Dior lady art and then we're shooting some content with Jeff who I love in this outfit 
I'm proudly can say that I haven't uh, stained yet. <laughs> oh my god, I hope I didn't jinx myself. Good morning. just finished our shoot with Dior it was so fun and love that I have some finally some photos that have Miami as a background I feel like since we moved all I've been shooting was kind of indoors so it's awesome now we have a little break going home the kids are supposed to be that what time is it well it's 12 22 oh, still have a little bit of downtime then we'll we'll move to the next one it's a marathon, but it's like nice. So this has been nice. <laughs> and like I, calming. Yeah. Let's keep the energy and the pace this way for the rest of the day. Exactly. Eight hours later. I'm on my way to the dinner that the daily front row is throwing. Went through a lot of wardrobe malfunctions. It's also been a very long day and I'm kind of exhausted and kind of feel a bit defeated because I haven't seen the kids at all today like I've seen them but I've been like in and out and like literally 10 minutes before I start getting ready we received a package for some gifting and this dress was in it and I was like I'm comfortable I feel chic this is my outfit for today and then I had like brownish shoes just did my baby blue Kelly I'm really excited. I know some of my friends will be there. So it's going to be just like a nice evening to network, socialize, and just see some people that I haven't seen in a while. So. We're at the Daily Front Row party and we're very, like we're starving, hence why I haven't been vlogging because I have nothing to say until I eat. But we're just at the bar, away from the actual party, to warm up Kimmy and Valeria is getting a glass of water. Okay, we started our day a little bit later today, getting ready for an awesome event with Chanel. I actually had like a couple of things canceled and then I also decided to really shrink my day because it was a lot. The kids just came home. Always perfect timing, exactly when I'm starting to get glammed up and, uh, and that's it. We're like in the middle of Art Basel. Is it Wednesday? Today's Wednesday. Woo! Two more days. Remember how in the beginning of this video, the first day I was like, this is gonna be so fun because it's like I'm at home and then I get to do the work and come back to the kids. Scratch that, that does not work. It's much easier when I'm like in a different country to attend to like work events because then I'm actually there mentally and physically and energetically. This week has been a bit challenging because you come back to like all this life stuff, grown up. Stuff. You have tennis today, you remember? Yeah. Okay. We're going for super clean, fresh, very Chanel inspired look. We're gonna be focusing on the lips. I feel like I've been doing a lot of eyes this week. So we're gonna make sure that the skin looks pretty, the eyes are clean, and just a really nice lip color. Cha cha. Uh, you want to do some pictures here, just in of course case. I do. With the coffee? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. No, ma'am. Send me all the pictures you took. Hello, sir. Okay, see you later. Thank you, bye. Hello. Good evening, thank you. Oh my goodness. Chanel signs everywhere. Mm. 
promotional signs. Cute. Okay, we arrived to this Chanel event. So beautiful, it's on the beach. It's so ugly, I didn't wear heels. <laughs> Kim is wearing heels. Yeah, but they're <laughs> Thick, so they're thick. I'm not thinking. <laughs> um, I see somewhere where they're shaking something, and I feel like I see. A... Oh, hi! Sure, sure, let's take a picture. I'll be right back. diamond I would like drones we left the Chanel event it was so beautiful it was so nice apparently it's like choreographed drones like you have to put like there's a coder that, I don't know. I'm gonna google it when I come home I got a little goodie do you know the story behind this situation <laughs> no maybe there's a song because I feel like that's like the biggest thing about the Faina Hotel. The mammoth comes from a time and place that we cannot ever fully understand. Despite its scientific reality, it has attained an almost mythical status. And I wanted to play with these ideas of legend, history, and science by Damien Hirst. Oh, beautiful. Isn't Damien Hirst one who used to do like a lot of naked bodies? I don't know, Kimmy. I'm not as ed educated as you. Oh, Gossip Girl. <laughs> Oh, so nice. This is my full length mirror in this household. Not me. Another day, another dollar. We're going to the Ferragamo preview before the luncheon. We're checking out their boutique. There's no memory card. Okay, we're going to the Ferragamo preview at the Ferragamo boutique at the MDD. I'm very excited because we're gonna look at clothes. Hello! Thank you so much Ferragamo for having me and for letting me host it. I hope we'll enjoy and uh, get to know each other and uh, enjoy this beautiful day. Good morning! So I didn't get to film yesterday the Chanel boutique opening because it was insane. There were a lot of people there. And uh, for me, I really wanted to make sure that I speak to certain people. So didn't really vlog, but it was beautiful. And if you guys are visiting Miami, it's such a gorgeous, gorgeous boutique in the Miami Design District. So highly recommend to check it out. Honestly, we were there for like 30 to 40 minutes and we left. I came home. Courtney, who is our caregiver now and the house, she wasn't feeling well. So I sent her home to rest. I put the kids to sleep. Gary was out for dinner and just went back to like full mode mom life. But uh, this morning... Morning. It's a slower day and today is also our last day of events and activations. We are actually shooting in the morning. We are shooting 12 days of giveaway, which I am doing in partnership with some of my favorite, favorite sponsors. This is something that I'm excited to do every year for the holidays to give stuff for free 
for uh, my amazing community online. So we're shooting photos and kind of promotions for that. So just so you understand the way it works, like when I have any kind of week, like a fashion week or any kind of like event based things before it starts, myself and like my uh, team, like the creative team will sit down and we're like, okay, I want to shoot these TikToks and this is what I want to do. And I want to do outfit of the day and I want to do pictures and I want to do transitions and I want to do makeup stuff. So we have like a list every day, a working list of like all the things we need to capture because otherwise you just like you can't keep up. And especially during these really busy times of, you know, event driven uh, weeks, you sometimes forget to create content at all because you're trying to be in the experience you're trying to be present to bring value to um, the people that you're working with and also to yourself like to understand okay this is what I'm doing and and leave the event being like oh I experienced something because what happened I feel like with content creation I got to a point where I was so burnt out because I was completely like not aware of what I was doing because I was so rigid on like creating content that I wasn't actually living and experience it and I would leave an experience or a trip or like a project with a with someone and I'll be like what did I just do I think that it's really confusing to try to create content while also being present and doing things and meeting people so I'm really happy that I actually have support and hence why we really started hiring people to support me on that but anyways I don't know where this is going I didn't I had one sip of my coffee so I'm just rambling on today I'm gonna take it slow today um in the morning I mean slow I have probably like half an hour to just chill then I'm gonna shower and do my makeup and start shooting 12 days of giveaway my face like hurting from all the makeup. I'm not even gonna mention my hair. Of course, this just happened to me, of course. <sighs> okay, Friday. This is a Monday thing, not a Friday thing, okay? <laughs>